Good morning, Life School of Cliff. My name is Elijah Simpson. Today is April 9th, 2018, and here are your daily announcements. If you will please stand to honor the flag. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, and liberty and justice for all. And now for the Texas flag. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to the Texas, one state, under God, one and indivisible. And now for a moment of silence. Attention students, next week most of you will be taking the STAR test or two and I wanted to give you some pointers and help remind you of a few of the testing procedures. First of all, we want you to be ready to do your best, so make sure you get plenty of sleep the night before, make sure you get a good breakfast, and be at school by 7.45 in the morning on the day of your test. Some restaurants do offer free breakfast, so keep an eye out for that. Secondly, always make sure you're in dress code. Remember that technology of any type is not allowed during testing by staff or students. Microwaves will not be used by staff or students. And parents are not allowed to bring you your lunch during the testing day. So you gotta have your lunch with you when you arrive at school. I will have your testing locations posted on the high school office, the middle school lockers, and outside every single counselor's office so you know where to go. Okay, so make sure, remember, get plenty of sleep, eat a good breakfast, be on time to school, and always do your absolute best. Have a great testing week, guys. Okay, flip it down. Okay, flip it. Attention juniors and seniors, if you are scheduled to go on David Buster Field trip tomorrow, you need to report to the East Gym no later than 8 o'clock. To verify your eligibility to attend the trip, check Google Classroom. If you have late arrival, you need to make a plan to come earlier. If the field trip buses leave without you, you will be assigned to a testing room for the remainder of the school day. Dress code for the field trip is any light school top in appropriate jeans. Appropriate jeans are defined as those that do not show any skin through holes in the denim fabric. If you come to school inappropriately dressed, you will be assigned to a testing room and given an alternate assignment. Your package at David Buster's includes lunch and a $15 game card. If you wish to play more games, you will need to bring additional cash. Seniors, once you arrive back on campus, from the field trip, you are encouraged to quietly leave the campus and go for the go home for the remainder of the school day. If you choose not to leave campus, you will have to remain in the East Gym until further notice or the end of the school day. Juniors, once you arrive back on campus from the field trip, you must report to the gym and remain there until classes are released back to normal or the end of the school day, whichever comes first. Attention seniors, class of 2018. You have two important days coming up before mid-April. Johnson's will be on campus Wednesday, April 11th at 3 o'clock in High School 106 to deliver your cap and gown and any invitation class rings or other graduation type items you ordered. Only seniors who have completed completely paid off their senior fees will be permitted to pick up their cap and gown next Wednesday. Please see Ms. Kaczynski if you need a total balance on how much you still owe to finish your V's. 
if you are bringing a non life school date to prom or a date who's in grades 9 through 11, you must pay your $50 guest fee to Ms. Kaczynski no later than Friday, Friday April 13th. <clears throat> Both juniors and seniors need to make sure that they are checking Google Classroom on a regular basis for important class dates and updates. Attention middle school students, if you have not turned in your course selection form for next year, there are extra copies on the bulletin board outside of Ms. Zell's office in Portable One. Even if you're not planning to return next year, these forms are required. Thank you. There will be a sock up every Friday in April at the East Campus Gym in the morning. The time will start from 7.15 a.m. to 7.50 a.m. You can expect an open gym on one side, fun, and music on the other. The price of admission will be $1. Attention 8th graders, the middle school prom is around the corner, so come and get your tickets in advance from Ms. Collins or Ms. Bacham. A Bacchus? Before or after school, the price is $10 in advance and $15 at the door. It will be May 11th from 7.30 to 10.30 at the DeSoto Civic Center. The last blood drive of this school year will be next Monday, April 16th. You must be 16 years or older to donate. Seniors must give at least two times during their senior year in order to wear the red cord for graduation. To sign up or for a question, see Dr. Russell in room 106, Help NHS Save Lives. Here are some of the athletic news and announcements from around. The boys soccer team beat Gainesville last Friday night in the quarter regionals by the score of 2-1. to one. They qualified for the Region 1-2-4A tournament for their fourth straight year and will play San Elizario in the semifinals at 6 this Friday night at Burrville Athletic Complex. Great job by the players and Coach Bishop. To keep up with all the news, highlights, and announcements, make sure and check out our website at www.lifeschools.net. Or you can follow Life School Oak Cliff on Twitter at Life underscore Lions. Thank you for watching. And until next time, my name is Elijah Simpson. We'll see you tomorrow with more line updates.